2007, I traveled to the tiny African country of Rwanda and learned the true importance of friendship. As a missionary, I embarked on a trip that I would remember for the rest of my life. Rwanda was hit with the genocide in 1994, only 14 years ago. Over 1 million Hutus and Tutsis were killed because of the hatred that the tribes had toward each other. This killing spree was not met with a lot of resistance by outside countries, which is why an entire generation is wiped out. I visited many hospitals, AIDS clinics, orphanages, and refugee camps while in Rwanda in search of broken people. These people who had to grow up with no community and no parents had no one to turn to but their friends. And a, a war broke the genocide broke My father tried to hide us somewhere in the bush. He tried to hide us in different places because he wanted one of us to survive if it, in case someone were killed. At that time, when we were still hiding, I didn't know that my, my mom and my dad and my, my dad and my, my, my two brothers were just killed. We didn't have a family. And when the pastor Barnes came, and he was so kind to tell me, come, live in my He told me, you will come stay with us, you will eat what we eat, we will sleep well with you. The bill is so kind to me. I didn't know that anyone could really care about me. And when he told me, stay with my own children, you will just live like life without living. I was raised. Without friends, Rwanda would be in the same shape it was 14 years ago. The bond that friends have can get you through most anything, as I saw firsthand in Rwanda.